was something back when I was a kid in, in South Carolina. I, lived, I grew up in North Carolina, so it's North and South Carolina. It's the South, the Bible Belt. And uh, I remember when I was a kid in South Carolina in the 80s, there was a report of a lizard man sighting in South Carolina and they made all these t-shirts and like, come see the lizard man of blah, 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 South Carolina. And I always thought that was cool. And uh, of course it went away and no one ever found the lizard man. Uh, but that was just some little legend thing we had that, I don't know, I wish I had the t-shirt of it though. Some little green like swamp thing looking monster. Pretty cool. Favorite movie monster. I have fav many favorite movie monsters. For me, it's hard to, you know, people. Get, I'm such a horror fan, and they, they, you know, always the question is, what's your favorite movie? And I always say Texas Chainsaw Massacre one or two. Cause that's like my two favorite. But you know, it's hard for me. It's just kind of like it's kind of like music. You know, I have classic rock I like. I like metal that I like. I like this type of music. So it's. Movies are all different, so when I to say to pick a favorite monster, I could say Leatherface, but he's one of my favorite new monsters. But I also love Frankenstein, the original. I love the original Wolfman, Creature from the Black Lagoon. All those original Universal monsters are undeniably the best. And so I have favorites from every genre. So of the old Universal genre, the creature is one of my favorites. I don't know why. Uh, and then of the newer stuff, you know, Leatherface and Texas Chainsaw Massacre is my favorite movie. I collect everything on that movie from toys to books, magazines, posters, t-shirts. I know just about everyone from all the movies and became friends with them. And, and uh, so, yeah, so I would say if I'm obsessed with any monster or movie franchise, it's definitely Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> I am the one that sits at the foot of your bed When you think you're alone at night